Hey guys, today we're going to do application problem 11.3. So it says journals for um, Meriden Industries are given in the working papers. Journalize the following transactions during December of the current year um, in January of the next year. Use page 12 of the general journal and page 16 of the cash payments journal. So that was the first thing I did was write 12 and 16 on my journals. Then I move on and it says source documents are abbreviated as followed. Check is C, memorandum is M. So on December 15th, the board of directors declared a dividend of 24 cents per every share. The capital stock issued was 120,000 shares. So we go ahead and we multiply 24 cents times 120 shares. And if you do that math, you should get 28,800. So I'll write the date first. It was the 15th. And it's the new account called dividends because we declared dividends. What's going on here is they wanted to show like a sh very shortcut journal. So they're saying like, okay, there's nothing here or let they, they want to show you that it's continuous. So they're saying we technically already had the date up here and you're just adding on another, another row. So that's what's happening here. They just like give you a, sh a clip of the general journal and the cash payment journal. Normally it takes up the whole page. So anyways, dividends and dividends payable. That's what we do when we declare a dividend. There's nothing else. That's just what we do. M60 or M260 was the document number. And then 28,800, 28,800 as the credit. Liabilities are normal balance of a credit. Dividends normal balance is a debit. Then on January 15th, we paid cash for dividends declared on December 15th. So this was January 15th now. So you don't necessarily have to write the date. If you do, it's not that big of a deal um like you don't have to write january but if you do it's okay because technically what they're saying is this is a continuous journal and the date was already written on the top so anyways we're paying off the dividends so the account that is going to be debited is dividends payable so dividends payable for twenty eight thousand eight hundred. And then we have cash credited because we've actually paid cash is what it said, paid cash for. And the document number was check number 954. There you have it, application 11.3.